Hey, what's up, guys? It's Sick, and I'm going to do a quick video for you guys on the new Red Guides launcher. Now, I've been helping out quite a lot of people tonight, uh, people who already have Very Vanilla installed, who's trying to use this launcher and having some issues. So we'll do it for the very first time. So I'm going to click on this uh, this link here. I'll, I'll put it in the uh, in the video, and we're going to download the new launcher. It's going to ask me where to put it. I'm just going to uh, dump it on my desktop here. So desktop, it's going to download it. <clears throat> and we're going to fire it up. Going to install this bad boy. Doesn't matter. It, it defaults to your program data folder. So we're going to do that. Now, that. now this is where some folks have had problems. Because it defaults loading in there, we need to specify where we're where we want it to put our uh, where we want to put to uh, our MQ2. Okay, so we have this here. So we click the login page. It should open up a, uh, a browser window and then uh, kick us back here. So it sees that it's me. Welcome, sick. That's me. And uh, I'm going to go to settings. And if you notice, this macro to quest directory is empty. So I'm going to open this up, and I'm going to point it to wherever I have my MQ2 folder. So we'll just say right here, MQ2 uh, release. So I want to point it to my release folder. I'm going to click OK. Now I'm going to go to very vanilla, and I'm going to click install. Now it's going to do some thinking. I'm packing some files down here. You'll see a little, a little progress bar. If you have slow internet, um, it you know might take a little bit before it gets fired. But if you notice, it started downloading all my uh, all my paid plugins, right? And so successfully installed, last installed, blah. Uh, plugins here. We have these here. Uh, Monk for some reason didn't install. Okay, so I click that. So these are all installed. I can go back to the home. Sorry, I can go back to the very vanilla. Say I want to launch EQBCS2, and I'm going to launch MQ2, and it's going to fire fire that up and open my Mac request 2. So uh, that's it. That's all, that's all you have to do. It's super easy, and now it manages all my plugins, and if there are any macros that either I own or macros that I'm watching, um, like right here, I have it watching Pocket Farm from Kayan, uh, I can install that bad boy, last updated, blah, blah, blah. See? Update all these. Good to go. But this settings spot is where a lot of folks are having issues this evening. So just make sure your MacroQuest 2 directory is pointed to the release folder of your current MacroQuest drive. Uh, but that should be it. Anyway, love you guys, and have a great night.